Hi, I'm Scott. And I'm Oscar. And together we are the Ginfluencers UK. The gin we're trying today is 71. There this you go. One here. This is a luxury gin and has now been launched at Selfridges as well as Hedonism Wines in Mayfair, which is one of our all's favourite shops. It is. We love going there. Among the A-list celebrities of this luxury liquid is Madonna, who has been seen multiple times with this distinctive octagonal Art Deco style bottle. And it is beautiful. <laughs> it's lovely. An after hours gin aged over 71 nights to be served neat, naked or on the rocks. 71 Gin goes through multiple distillation processes inspired by the most sophisticated perfumery techniques using only prestige ingredients blended by the master distiller Steve Wilson before being aged in various rare oak casks. That's a lot of work going That's on there. <laughs> the botanicals include juniper, angelica, damask rose, grapefruit and cinchona. You got that right. <laughs> The liquid is then matured in three different oak casks for 71 nights. At the end, the remarkable touch of the queen of the night flower, which is, as I believe, Sensalius grandiflorius, <laughs> I've probably got that wrong, is added. The only flower at night, and it has a really strong and beautiful fragrance. It has indeed. Well, we'll find out, won't we? <laughs> Where can you find this drink? Where well, it's available it? of sophisticated London bars, such as Harry's Bar, Annabelle's, Isabel's, The Savoy, The Main, The Connaught, The Box, Lalo, Santa Mer, Treehouse Hotel London, Decimo at the Standard, The Mandrake and Chilton Firehouse. I've never been to any of those, so <laughs> I wouldn't know. So let's get open it and let's try it. So we are going to try it neat um, and then we're going to try it over ice. So um, this feels really special. So Scott got this for me at Christmas. I did. And I've been super excited to try it. Oh, there you go, it's open now. Oh, and a nice hefty weighty stopper. Right, there we go. Oh. And it just looks like a perfume bottle. Oh. Wow, there's a lot going on in there. Mmm. That's it's a bit ginny, but yeah. not overly ginny. Very strong. That's nice and warm. It's, it's oaky. very warming, very warming. It is very oaky. It's almost reminiscent slightly of a whiskey. Yes, yes, but I, th I, I mean, I, I don't like whiskies, but I actually prefer this taste, definitely. It is, I can see what they say when they kind of say it's kind of a nighttime drink. It is, it's, Oh, it's a bit cognac -y now. I was going to say, it's more cognac -y for me than it is whiskey. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm really, I'm really get, get, kind of getting that cognac -y feel for it. Um, yeah, this is, this, is, this is beautiful. Yeah, really like that, actually. This is really nice. I mean, I think that having um, it over ice would actually open it up. Yeah. Because obviously the water kind of releases it's a lot of It's a good job we're going to do it over ice. Right. So, we'll do our little Hollywood montage and we'll be back in a minute. Short one. So, cheers. Cheers, Oscar. Cheers, Scott. Now, Finger out. before we drink, put it down because I haven't told them the price yet. And because I've got it for you as a present, I don't want you to know. So the no, bottle, no. it's a 70 centiliter no, no, no. bottle and it's 140 pounds. So yeah, so I don't want him to hear that, but there we go, 140 pounds. Right, you ready? There you go. <laughs> I actually right. couldn't hear it. Did you not hear? No. I tried to I tried I've got to very talk big ear quietly. canal so I can get my finger in. Okay, thanks for that. Right, cheers. Cheers. Wow. Wow. Ooh. That, that really opens it up that so has, much. Have it over ice. I prefer it so much better. Oh, it's, it's like a milky taste. A milky taste? Yeah, that, that's really weird. It's like a milky taste to me. What, like a, an ice cream? A milky what? I don't know. What? Oh, that's really weird. Um, yeah, that's really nice. That's that's 
That is more like the cognac end for me. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I was waiting to see because normally you're behind me, so yeah. I, I didn't want to kind of. And I actually, your gift. I because I, I don't like brown spirits. I don't like whiskies or cognacs or whatever. I mean, I'd drink them if I had to, but they're not my choice. Whereas this, I think, is a very good crossover for me. Wow, I like this. We might yeah. have converted him. Um, well, it's still a gin. Yeah, so. it's you. You still get juniper there, but there is. I mean, if you had, if you had it and you weren't told what it was. It would be one of these perplexing ones. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. I could, yeah. If someone served that to me, um, I don't think it's as dark as as a full blown cognac in its taste. No, but it's got, it's got, it's light. It's actually quite a light taste. It's got elements of of a very very good whiskey. It's got elements of a cognac. You can taste you can taste the oak through there. Mm. It does taste warm. It does taste. I know it sounds ridiculous. Sophisticated. Uh, yeah, you can use that. It, actually, it does. It. I think it lends itself to not wanting to gulp this down. Yeah. Okay. It actually is something you would like this. Like this, I could imagine just sitting there and sipping this and enjoying this. Yeah, it's, de it's definitely a sipping gin. Well, this is the difference now because we're, we're so kind of focused on gin and tonics um, and gin with mixers that a lot of people don't drink gin neat. And I think it goes back to the fact of when we had other gins, they were really basic and they weren't very nice. Uh, neat, you had to put something with them for them to be a little bit more palatable. But now there's a, there's a lot of brands out there that are kind of going forward and going, right, it's it's a sipping gin and they're changing the way we drink gin. I think the more I drink it, the more I am getting a flower element come through. Really? Yeah, I'm getting a bit, bit not perfumey. It's, it is a little, it's, it's a bit perfumey. Hmm, I'm getting that. On the back, very, mm. very faintly. Ever so slightly. Ever so slightly. But it's very, it, it feels very sweet. It feels almost quite sticky. Like sweet sticky, a, a bit like molasses. Oh, not, see, I'm not, not getting that. You're not getting that? No. Like a little bit syrupy. I'm getting kind of really kind of sweet flavours go through. It is, it is sweet. I mean, it's an enjoyable, there's no, there's no bitterness there at all. And it's really yeah. sweet, nice taste. Molasses, I don't know. I'm actually getting though, I'm getting a really, really lovely warm feeling. I can see it. It's glowing. It's yeah, glowing. it's glowing. Yeah, um, yeah. It's it's the the strange thing is it's give it, it it doesn't burn, but it's a beautiful, beautiful warm feeling. That is mind, so much ice. better with ice. I think so too. Yeah. I think neat, neat. It was it was neat. It was neat lovely. was fine. It was it was. This it was is nice. more enjoyable with ice, and it is it is this this I would have with another gin, just to have it beside it to give me a, a bit of, I don't know, I can't explain it. I, I, have, I think I would have this if we'd had a nice meal, sitting down after the meal, you know when you're kind of relaxing, mm. this is when this is when I drink this. I'd still have a gin on the go, and I'd have this beside it. Would you really? Yeah. Like a gin gin chaser? A gin gin chaser. Gin gin, gin chaser. Gin, chaser. I, no, just I, for the fact of, it, it, I think it's resetting my taste buds. Because it is so different. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I think I think it's it, it lends itself to me that after after I've eaten, I will have a glass of this. The more I drink of that, the more I'm really liking that. I think we should score it. Right, let's score it. Oh yeah. <laughs> but it is it is a beautiful bottle. I mean, when I, when I saw it, I I just knew that I had to have it for him. Uh, so <laughs> you're welcome. Merry Christmas. Thank you. Right. Okay. Right. Okay. I'm ready. Yeah, I'm liking that. Right, go. Go. Yeah, 10. Easy 10. The, the annoying thing is, the annoying thing is, um, it's very expensive, but it's very expensive because of all the processes that it has to go to. And no doubt this packaging is hugely expensive as well. But you know, it is rested for, for 71 nights. Um, whereas a lot of other gins, unless they are rested, are pretty much ready to go. The That's reason it. I scored it a 10, I think I think it's a great taste, but for me it's definitely something that's it's very different and it is because I don't drink cognacs or mm. whatever, I could quite happily have this and feel included yeah, when people are. 100% and the more I'm drinking of this, the more it's palatable. See, I think we're going to have to go and check the bars out that it's in. <laughs> Well, why not? Um, but they need to be cosy. See, for me, this is a cosy drink. But well, any of those bars, if you're watching this, are you yeah. cosy? Are that, you cosy enough? Don't for make Oscar? it too bright in there. 
<laughs> right? Don't have loads of loud music playing too loud. All right, granddad. Right? No, no, I'm into, I'm into music, but just have it as background music so we can talk. Right? Just, just learn from that. Let's get back to the gym. Um, yeah, I, I think it's, I think it's fabulous. Um, it's, it's, you know, it's their first gin, and I think they've done tremendously well. I'd Packaging's like... great. The bottle looks amazing. Because you're clumsy. It's mine. All it's right. mine. I can drop it. If I wanted to smash this, I could smash this. I own this. There you go. <laughs> right. So look. I want to take it it's back. It's like now. A, now one of the details I really that stuck in me, right, is oh, when you open it. It's even got a little groove in there for that. That's that little bit there. That little metal thing, whatever it is, seal. It's actually even. They've even cut out the groove in here. Attention to detail. I really like. And it's got a little seal little one there on the, as well. on the side as well. Yeah. It is. It's. It's very good. It's very in very fact, good. It's a mag it's magnetic. <laughs> it's actually magnetic. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Uh, let's just see. Is it? Or is it yeah, just, it's oh, magnetic. Oh, it's magnetic as well. <laughs> see, there you go. Ow, look at, I was wondering why it was so hard to get off. That is awesome. Well done, well done you guys. <laughs> That's it, I didn't even notice that because I'm so heavy handed. Right, right, well, we loved it. Um, great gin, yeah. great packaging, well done, oh. worth every penny, whatever it costs. Well done to me. Yeah, well done to you, and thank you for my Christmas present. You're very welcome. Right, right there you bits. go. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Do let us know if you've tried that, right, if you tried it in one of the bars, and we'll see you next video. Cheers. 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 Cheers.